Welcome, Leo. This is the full moon readings. Let's go in and see what's coming up for you, Leos. Thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. These full moon readings have an extended. If you'd like to see the extended, um, it is good to use the link below or use the join button to get you to the extended. Um, the full moon is on May 22nd and it's a super full moon. Let's see what's coming up for you, Leo. So, all right, so Leos, I see um, you're coming in with the energy of information coming at you. Um, a lot of you are waiting for some sort of information. Let's see if this information is going to be coming in. Um, and there is going to be some sort of a new offer um, that could be coming up for you, Leos. Um, I see... Um, some some of you wanted to move forward. You are waiting for some sort of a message to move forward. Um, but this message might not come in. The message that is coming in is not going to be good. They're going to be recognizing because a lot of you, Leos, um, hope for some sort of a new start, hope for some sort of a new offer to come in. But they recognize something about your past, Leo. They recognize, I don't know, some so something about your past came up. A judgment call is going to be coming in and they're going to be um, seeing that there was some sort of an undesirable um, situation because a, a judgment call is going to be coming in in the third week. And this judgment call is from a bank financial institution or from your work. In the fourth week, I see you were hoping for some sort of a new start, but it's not going to be coming in, Leo. Um, you thought that in the first week it was going to be coming in, but I see a corporation institution recognize something about some sort of a application that you, Leos, had put in. And um, this... Uh, organization is recognizing something um, that something doesn't um, is to, is as if some sort of a data or information um, some of you are going to be heartbroken all right so a lot of you Leo's are dealing with a situation where you could have placed an application in okay one card fell out um, you could have placed an application for something um, but, um, whatever you were applying for Leo is not going to be happening. Okay. It's as if, um, a corporation institution is going to be recognizing, um, what has been happening and they're going to be going back and finding out something Leo's about the past. So you gotta be aware of, of this. Okay. All right. So you're coming in. A lot of you, your wishes and dreams is not going to be granted for whatever the issue, the situation is, is that a lot of you had hope for something to come in. A lot of you, Leo, was open, hoping, hoping for something to come in. But um, it's, and it's just as I said, you could have applied for something and was open that this thing is coming in, but it's not. So I see a lot of you, Leos, are having some sort of an issue, some sort of a problem with your kids. Um, some sort of a news that is coming in that is not going to be good. You Leos were waiting on some sort of an information to come in. A lot of you Leos are dealing with an Aries Leo Sagittarian and they're going to be recognizing something about this Aries Leo Sagittarian uh, in, at the workplace or at home. It could be your child. Um, a corporation institution is going to be recognizing something about this Aquarius, whether um, it is a work situation or in your private life. So um, we see that some of you were waiting for some sort of a news, but something from the past came out. Um, they are now looking at some uh, something from the past. It's as if some of you have applied for something and was open for this thing to come in, but then a uh, government corporation recognized something. Whatever they recognize, I see um, the news is not going to be good. I see some of you, Leo, was open for some sort of an offer to move forward um, in a corporation institution, but uh, it's not going to happen, and a lot of you are going to be looking for a new position. So I see sadness. You, Leos, are saddened. 
um, because you Leos were hoping for some sort of a new offer to come in, waiting for some sort of a news and hoping for some sort of a new offer to come in, but it's not going to be happening and it is going to be affecting a lot of you Leos. Then I see an end is here for a friend. Um, some of you Leos, some sort of a friendship could be ending or, um, this is like a karmatic situation and you're going around in circles, uh, um, with someone, whoever this person is, you're going around in circles with this person, and it's as if uh, you're in a um, on and off, on and off, on and off, on and off, on and off relationship. All right, judgment call is coming down, and um, I see some sort of a happiness with a house, uh, some sort of happiness um, at the workplace. Uh, some of you could have started your business. I see. Um, if you were thinking about this, it's, it's going to be happening for you. Happiness, um, um, long-term um, happiness, success, a, a whole lot of uh, celebration, okay? Um, then we see some sort of a good news is going to be, some sort of a news is going to be coming in. For some of you, it's good. Some of you, it's not good, okay? However, this is happening and transpiring because... Um, uh, some of you are receiving some sort of a news um, and I see that the news is from your company and it's going to be saying um, it's like, yeah, we're not going to be extending your um, your we're not going to be extending your um, contract, that sort of a thing or um, news that you are waiting from a company or a corporation. Uh, it's not going to be good for some of you, Leos, for some of you. Um, and some of you are going to be receiving some sort of an unconventional message from a corporation institution. So I see some sort of a news is coming in from a friend, a judgment call. It's like people who were applying for some sort of a government thing. It's not going to be a yes, Leos. Okay. Then we see a lot of you men wanted some sort of a new offer. It's not going to be coming in. I see they are recognizing something about you men in a corporation institution. If you were a manager or so, or something about a house or something that you men could have been working in a bank financial institution, there's no new start that is going to be coming up for you men because they're investigating something and they recognize what uh, something that has transpired in the past is going to be affecting you guys and now in the future. Let's look at the sun sign, okay? That is people who are born 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. All right, what are we seeing? We're seeing that, yes, the offer is not going to be coming in. So for sun sign people who had applied for something, um, it's going, the offer is the, um, the news that you're waiting on. Some of you um, were hoping for your wishes and dreams to be granted, and it's not going to be um, that is in the reverse. And I see a whole lot of sadness. Some of you wanted some sort of an offer, a whole lot of sadness. So, um, they are now recognizing what a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn man has done. And um, I don't know if this is your father, this is your husband, this is, a, um, you know, someone who financially supports you. But now they're going to be recognizing what a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person have done and because of what this person have done you are not going to be getting a new offer because they recognize that this man has done something and it's as if this man could have tried to um get something for you and create something for you on the false pretend and they are going to be recognizing so it's as if you leos if you're married to a taurus virgo or a capricorn person or this person is your father I see that a situation is not going to be a, some sort of an offer that you both at, um, apply for. It's not going to be coming true because of this man. They recognize that this man have created some sort of a fraud. And they're now putting the pieces of the puzzle together and recognizing um, that this man, some sort of a date or information, because it's as if this man wanted to give you some sort of a new story to... Um, uh, in your career but it's not going to be happening because they recognize that um the data and information that this man or you are pro provided leah was not yours 
a judgment call twice the energy of judgment call is coming up and this judgment call is coming up on a friend whoever this friend is it could be an Aquarian uh, person a judgment call it could be also if you had to apply for something um, from civil servants a judgment call is as if civil servants is going to be bringing out some sort of a judgment call on you Leos because they recognize uh, um, that some sort of a data or information is not correct for you Leos so judgment call is coming up on a, a friend if an a friend is an Aquarian they're going to bring out some sort of a judgment call on this person um you um young yeah young people uh, young people some sort of a judgment call and again young people between the age of 18 and 45 if your father or your husband or your partner but this is coming up as an older man that was financially supporting you a judgment call is coming down on Julius and this older man because they recognize uh, um, that this older man was trying to give you some sort of a new start, but as falsify some sort of a documentation or um, paper, something about your father, something about your husband that is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, they're going to be recognizing that you, Leos, somehow, some sort of a data information, they're going to be finding out that uh, I'm bringing down a judgment call on you, young people between the age of 18 and 45. And once you are connected, when is your boss that is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person I see a whole lot of problem for this man and it's affecting you Leo's uh, maybe it's your boss and uh, you and this person work together I see a judgment call for both you and this person you're both in the reverse form that means some sort of information came out and they're recognizing what you and your boss have done you and your father have done you and your husband have done and it's going to be affecting Leo's between the age of 18 and 45 now I see no new start for an Aries man and whatever is transpiring if you're married to an Aries man no new start is going to be coming up for this Aries man if this is your boss or supervisor no new start it could have been these two businessmen were partnered up and you Leo's were dragged in a situation and they have caught these two businessmen for something and it's affecting you Leo so maybe it's your husband maybe it's your um, father maybe it's your uncle your brothers uh, whatever is transpiring some of you young Leos are caught up in a situation between two um, older men these men are like 50 years and older Taurus Virgo or Capricorn or they are between the ages of uh, um, 45 years and older and you young Leos is caught up in a situation with this uh, um, these two men and th whatever the situation is you guys have some serious problem to deal with because this is definitely an Aries man and whatever this Aries man have done and however you uh, Leo's have collaborated with this Aries man the truth is now going to be coming out because a judgment call is going to be coming down and they're going to be recognizing um, that you young uh, Leo's was collaborated so I see um, it's as if uh, some of you were waiting, uh, applied for something and was open that this thing would come true, but it's not when it coming true because they recognize the collaboration between you, Leos, and uh, an older Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man for some of you and a, a Harry's man for some of you. And whoever these people are and whatever is transpiring, there is just some serious complication that is going to be transpiring because I see the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man um, is not going to be getting the offer that they tried to create some sort of an offer for you, Leos, but it's not going to be happening. Then when we look, oh, I see a judgment call is coming down on your friends, Leos, and no new start is coming up for um, your friends. Then for you, young Leos, and I'm talking about Leos um, between the ages of 18 and 45, I see a judgment call is coming down and this judgment call is not going to be good because I see... Um, it's as if people are celebrating over you, Leos, some sort of a judgment call with your business, some sort of a judgment call at the workplace, some sort of a judgment call over a house. And you, Leos, uh, are not going to be 
um happy about this so um young leos and with the aries some of you whoever this aries man is uh, they're recognizing that this aries man this aries man is a businessman or a business investor but um you're going to be receiving some sort of a message from this person that they can't help you anymore leo so however this is transpired maybe it's your husband in another country and this person is having some sort of a problem or but whatever it is the message is not good because this man is now caught up in some sort of a problem and issue let's look at the moon sign people so if you were born 6 p.m to 6 a.m let's see what is transpiring so i see um some sort of a news is coming in and they're going to be uh, putting a block on uh, some of your young Leos. Whatever is happening, I see they're going to be blocking you from trans, um, from um, a traveling. Uh, you can't um, travel, especially young Leos. Young Leos and young Aries. If you have a friend that is an Aries, young Leos and young Aries is going to be having some sort of a blocked placed on them. Whatever the news is, they're going to be blocked from moving forward. Uh, they wanted to move forward, but uh, um, um, there is a lot of you standing your ground, especially young women. You're standing your ground because you wanted to move forward, but there is some sort of a block that is going to be placing on you young ladies or young people who wanted to move forward. I see a corporation is standing their grounds because some of you could have been connected to an Aries Lee or Sagittarian man and they recognize what this Aries Lee or Sagittarian man have done and um, I see that they're protecting, they're blocking a situation and protecting a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn business. Whoever this woman is, is as if some of you Leos together with a uh, Aries person have done something to this woman business and um, a corporation is protecting this woman from you uh, Leo and Aries because of something that you have done to this business woman so I don't know if it was your supervisor things didn't work out and then you Leo's tried to get back to this person but I see the corporation is going to be protecting this woman and it's coming up as a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn woman and uh, you Leo's have done something against this uh, business woman and um, it's as if um, an, a government institution organization is now recognizing what you um, have done to this person and this government corporation is protecting this Capricorn uh, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn woman. I see a lot of you Leos are going to be successfully overcoming a Pisces Cancer or Scorpion woman. I see you're successfully celebrating over this Pisces Cancer or Scorpion woman um, because some sort of a problem. Um, this person and her child could have created some sort of a problem for you Leos. Um, maybe this is your mom and you're going to be celebrating with your mom. Some of you could be celebrating overcoming some sort of a problem and issues and you and your mom is celebrating because you're get you and your mom is getting out of some sort of a problems and issues that was created by other people. So I see some of you Leos could be going back home to live with your mom if your mom is a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion person. So that is good. Again, we see some sort of a conflicts, conflicts and competition with a friend. Some of you Leo was creating. A whole lot of conflicts and competing against a friend but this is going to be over because it's as if the universe recognize that uh, you need to walk away from a situation um, because they're recognizing that you're using um, your energy to compete and it's not about competing it's about to learn um to balance out your karmas okay so it's as if you leo's is as if the the wheel of fortune is in reverse and is saying hey leo's what you're doing is not what you need to do you need to recognize that you have karma and you need to work out this karma with this person and not trying to create competition and conflicts okay then we see this offer and uh, um whatever is happening and transpiring um, with this offer, um, this offer that is um, that some of you wanted, I see it's not going to be coming in um, because what they're recognizing is that uh, 
Um, yes, I see regrets for this offer. Uh, Julius really, really wanted a new offer, but I see regret for this offer. And I see that Julius, together with a cancer, I'd hope to get through something. And uh, it's as if you had collaborated. Some of you, Leos, could have collaborated with a cancer and was uh, applied for something. I was open um, to get this thing. So it's as if a cancer gave you data and information, documentation, together with a older uh, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn man, and they recognize that the information and data is not um, correct. And I see regrets because uh, a whole lot of you, Leos, is going to be regretting that you didn't re get, um, receive an offer. So it could be a, a job offer of your apply for something um, and you're recognizing that it's not going to be, you're not going to be receiving this offer. So, you know, it is sometimes um, the universe is protecting you. Um, a lot of you Leos are dealing with an Aries, uh, really dealing with an Aries man. And I see uh, sadness because you recognize that if this Aries man is your father or um, your boss or whoever this Aries man is, your stepfather, or you have some sort of a dealing with this Aries man, neither you or this Aries man is going to be getting this offer because they're going to be recognizing um, that if it's your boss, you're connected to this Aries man. If it's your father, you're connected to this Aries man. And um, it, it, it's a situation where you Leo's, because of this Aries person, you're not going to be getting something that you had wanted i do love you guys use um the link below to look if you're a sun sign or moon sign um use the link here to join to see the extended of these full moon readings i do love you guys i gotta go namaste until next time